second to show you how to set up a firewall to uh, require you whitelisting it. So I personally use Avast. Uh, you have to have root access to be able to do this. Under the firewall settings here, let this load. Enable firewall. And I choose whitelist mode. That's what I have set. Uh, you change it here to, if you want a blacklist or whitelist. Uh, I enable support, obviously. Um, I should probably do that. But, yeah. And then you can just change. It takes a while to get them set up, but once you have it set up, um, anything that you install will automatically be blocked without. So if you install malware on an accident or something, um, it just automatically blocks it without you doing anything. So it wouldn't be able to get out to the internet to contact its command and control or anything like that. And then you can analyze it and figure out exactly what it's doing before you unblock it and whatnot. So it's also kind of nice where if you didn't want your, for instance, your system updates to take any data. If you don't have unlimited data, that's pretty nice. So, and that's how you do it.